Hi, I'm Zsuzsa from the From Chaos to Order blog. In this video I will give you a little up update about my personal size Malden in Kingfisher Blues color. I use this planner since a couple of weeks but I too a lot of change over the year. It's because the rings are for me too small and I have to think on what uh, to keep here and what not. Uh, and I bought this week a purple Malden, <laughs> a used Malden personal, and I will. I think I will a little bit split between the two planners to addition to my hundreds other planners. So. That's it. I stuffed this um, pocket more um, because they cause nothing in the rings. I have here some cash just for case. I have sometimes no cash and then maybe I can park. Then I have that here. And uh, washi sample and um, this little page markers or tops. I'm very happy to found these. Uh, they are, pff, I don't know, really. Um, okay, so, but they are small and they are paper. Oh, I have to make maybe some light. It's rainy day, at least, not so hot, so I can write on this uh, with normal pens. What's important, because if I want to make a new section or something to re remember, uh, on the way I might don't have a, a marker also this permanent marker with me just normal um, pen so I keep that here I have um, stickers stickers and sticky notes here this little one I love and I'm so happy that I found some masking stickers matches so much well here to this planner and I have more from these I like to use the, these as labels more washi sample I mostly use in this planner they are matching very good more masking Stickers and this is my sticker collection I made for myself but I don't like this size I will make I don't know what size but um, it's not here between two uh, project, project life cards and let's start <laughs> um, the first uh, dashboard keeps couple of uh, sticky notes then I have a pocket here I made myself for I don't know for anything I might need to keep here and uh, I added this extra pen loop from Leichtturm uh, for my highlighter then I have a page here, this is my inbox. I write quick to do's here when I can't write them into my to do list app. And I have in my daily um, review a task to go through on this, and I copy then to the to do list. Then the notes section, this is also just quick notes and I copy it always to the right place. Then um, info papers, some 
other notes and drawings. I love this sentangle thing. I added this uh, as a try for my kids chores and I want to make an inset if I if this works it's weak on two page like this this is a half week I keep here most important tasks they have and I copy here um, yeah every day but uh, they don't have to do all task on all days because some days they, one kid comes too late at home then she she don't have to do at that much but it it's uh, it's in dry and um, yeah uh, what I didn't mention I cut uh, slips to all pages that I can remove or add very quick and I don't have to open the rings because uh, here at the beginning at the end it's then fall everything out then um, yeah labels are not anymore <laughs> uh, well <laughs> because this is not a family section this is a monthly section I took out the um, week on two pages there, there was too colorful for me and I didn't sew anything on that and um, then I added some routine tasks here that I don't forget to schedule and uh, I made last week this fold out calendar uh, mostly calendar it's because um, you might remember I added here before a normal uh, week or uh, more than two page calendar it was too small but I told I can keep here only things uh, my stuff but I missed the whole overview for the family and uh, for that I haven't enough space then I made this fold outs and um, yeah, it has to uh, try if I can uh, go with it because um, it's a little bit hard so when I, I'm this is the current month and it's uh, when I go to the next month then uh, hmm, how to open it it's a little bit uh, <laughs> complicated uh, but to write it's okay the folding line I made that it's not in the middle in any day it's between two days so I can flip that the stickers uh, up appointment stickers made myself these little um, circle stickers also and um, that was very helpful here's a little trick um, this is our uh, vacation and it will be a chaos uh, pff, kids are here and there and sometimes together sometimes separate in different places so I um, add the colors for all kids and then I wrote on that where, who is, when. So as you can see, this is it. Then this is the couple of monthlies, and I always has a whole year monthlies in my planner, and like this, it's impossible. But. Um, I have a binder, a very cheap binder where I can keep uh, all my next inserts. It has a little bit bigger rings and I have here until January and the weeklies and a lot of uh, dailies and other inserts. I will use later 
So, um, after that I keep here some more appointment stickers I made uh, for personal size um, the planner <coughs> called planner but the uh, monsters was was a planner maybe weekly section should I uh, call it and I might take this five year planner out because this needs a lot of space and here is the same yearly uh, stuff yearly planner only for patterns, knitting patterns uh, when so project uh, when are they happening and um, we uh, monthly plan for only work plan and I thinking I will take this also out because I don't really need this here so I can keep this in another planner and uh, I copied um, tasks to the days when it's coming and um, so how it's work here is the week this is what I changed I throw out the I don't know from where I printed out free printable week on two pages was too colorful and um, I was unable to see what's on it so I asked in some Facebook group that someone maybe have um, file effects week on two page inserts because my, this is so thin paper then I can keep from these a lot more. <laughs> I am considering also for next year to buy uh, daily pages from Friday Facts and find out how to print on them my own stuff or pff, I don't know uh, but uh, I love the thicker paper to use but uh, if I can only keep some of them in in the planner then it's silly because I need a lot of paper I have I want to try also to print on tomorrow river paper I think I have personal size from that it uh, yeah let's see what I made then didn't mention I made a big big mistake here uh, when I uh, made this um, okay here not this uh, cuts I thought I make it sure and uh, use the washi but washi needs a lot lot of space in rings I don't have to make this anymore so where was we so um, between the week the current week I keep the current day this is the same as uh, I used before I love this uh, layout today also and uh, I keep before all the weeklies the last couple of days that I can go back and uh, see if I want then I, I archive them every day and I can toss after a week or something but a couple of days I keep here and I marked this with a um, page track or top or something and um, I have also a tab after the weeklies they are until end of August for the next couple of days so if I want to write something for tomorrow I can flip here very quick and uh, write it here and uh, they are also cut out so I can move these pages very quick I made this um, today marker but I'm not sure that I like it I thought it will be handy because I can see through uh, yeah the half uh, 
of the week because <laughs> I always have my today here so for the second half of the week I have flip it's no question yeah, but that was a fun um, DIY project here I also use here stickers I made myself for the tasks it's because I don't write too much uh, tasks here and first I wrote it only with a pen and I really don't see how much tasks they are that's why I made this simple stickers uh, for myself, okay, here is two things, here is one thing, the big thing uh, uh, for the day work stuff and uh, it's color coded, I use this color for work and I use other colors for uh, family and other stuff, so this is not a task, this is a deadline for a test, it will be finished on the weekend and I use the same um, appointment stickers as in the monthly calendar but they are bigger so uh, next week we will moving and um, it's uh, really chaotic in my head that's why I made this uh, extra stick sticky note for today that I cover my today's list and first I must do this stuff. I shouldn't make a video for you but I do it <laughs> because I want it. Yeah and uh, if I'm done with these I can go through my other things or not if I didn't finish. So a couple of more weeks here are already filled out. Uh, because of two reasons, because I love to make plans and uh, use stickers and <laughs> the calendar, yeah, I'm a little bit crazy and I know uh, that I won't have time in the next weeks for that. Yeah. So that was the planning section. And so list is the same, nothing um, happened here, some to-do lists and uh, online orders, just list paper. This is a beautiful paper, but this is also thick. I will use them because I have them. And meeting notes is the same, just some paper and notes about what we are talked about, uh, with my colleagues and Miss Cancer's thing for my daughter stickers I got more stickers two of my daughters I don't found any other uh, picture for my third one and more stickers and uh, some notes about friends and oops uh, numbers and some other informations here and finished I I say if I see others other setups people have this and that and that and that and a lot of stuff in the Malden and I I don't understand this is magic or what because I have only a couple of things here and it's full see drinks are full and I want more here more lists and uh, stuff what makes fun for me and I cannot I have here some notes really only a few pages three months monthly couple of weeks weeklies t one or two week dailies couple of sheets, lists, couple of sheets for the notes and some stickers and it's full. Yeah, what can I do? 
maybe buy some uh, really thin paper in the back. I have more stickers. The, uh, these these uh, simple stickers for uh, tasks. Okay, and a reminder for something. The dots. Yeah. And a notebook for I don't know <laughs> because it fits here and it's cute. Yeah, that's it. Uh, my new modern setup. I hope you enjoyed it. And um, if you have any question for me, please ask in the comment section below. And if you have um, any ideas how I can fit here more, uh, I would be really happy <laughs> to read it. If you like the video, please give me a thumb up. That helps me through growing my channel and if you want to uh, get informed about the new videos then subscribe to the channel. See you next time. Bye!